What's up, dogs? This is Sabre Fire Four. Uh, trying out uh, Dusknor again. Dusknor spell tag. Good combo, obvious combo, cool deck. I wish it was better. I mean, it should have been better. Uh, it's just the format that's wrong. Uh, with all the tag teams getting all the love and all the healing. Uh, nevertheless, uh, we're gonna keep trying, at least for now. So let's see, I'm going to open up with this Duskull again. We started with it last game too. Uh, that 40 HP is really is really bad. That's another downside on this deck. But I mean, who knows, maybe I'll, I'll use his ability and try and get Dusclops turn 1 again. So Mysterious Treasure, let's discard Psychic Energy and the Dusclops is in the deck. So maybe I should attempt, I should attempt to try and evolve into it. Uh, let's see, so, discard the other Psychic Energy too. You can kind of afford to do it, I think, in this deck. The other stuff is more valuable. And go with the Poke Gear, and there's the Lily, just exactly what I want to see. Get that extra draw, extra cards, since this is turn 1. Pretty, pretty cool. And, uh, you know what, to play down the Mime, I mean, maybe I could have just discarded and go with the Dusclops play, but you know what, we need the Pijotos, I need the Elm, so, yeah, and the Mime, God, it's just going to waste space on my bench again, I just played it, but, I mean, I'm just, I hope there's some use for it, like, they run scoop ups, super scoop ups or something, but, I guess nobody does, anyway, uh, yeah, if, if I get my Shadow, that gets rid of uh, stadiums and tools and whatever, then I would I would run that in place of this guy, but since we don't, uh, they're still mime. And my opponent is playing again is using a Mewtwo and Mew GX. Uh, it's probably well I don't want to say probably I always want to be sure, but uh, leave it leave a little bit of doubt, not be a hundred percent. But you know what? It is the best deck of the format right now, in standard, and I would say in expanded too. It's even better. So normally, because it's weak to Psychic, uh, this would be a decent matchup for Dusknor because we can hit it for 120 for 1, and it's actually not bad. But these decks usually run Jirachi, uh, the Jirachi from Unified Minds, and that gets rid of the weakness, so uh, that sucks. So let's see, I'm gonna just going to go ahead and play the Shrine. I'm not going to be stingy this time. i got to get the damage on these guys. And go with Elm, get two PGs and get a Pijoto. I didn't need to get a Pijoto actually, but I mean, my bench is full anyway, no matter what I search. So, Dusk, huh? and I'm going to go with Ominous Eyes, I guess, since he didn't do much. Uh, I guess in standard, this deck can struggle sometimes, uh, can brick. Uh, but yeah, I shouldn't have searched the Pijoto, maybe I should have searched another Pidgey or... Another Duskull, when this Duskull dies, the one in the active position. So, Fire Energy. So, this guy has two down. And it's going to go with Outrage. It's just enough to get the KO. Uh, it does enough, more than enough. Uh, because we have such low HP. But it is what it is. I did 70 damage at least. <laughs> I guess it's not bad. And as long as this Ryan sticks... Uh, the damage is going to add up. So bring out the Pajotos, two of you guys. And you better give me something because we don't have a supporter. And I get the spell tag. Uh, okay, but not great. I need a supporter or at least Dusk, Dusknor or some shit. And uh, Psychic Energy and Elm. Crap. Get, get another one of these guys, I guess. Another Elm. Yeah, it's really unfortunate. Another turn of just doing 20 damage. I guess we have another chance with this Elm. I didn't use a supporter yet, so... PG and Mew. Get you guys and play down the PG. Mm. Not what I wanted, but at least I guess we'll have all the three Pijotos out by next turn. So maybe I can start getting some significant turns after this. But yeah, attach the attach the spell tag again and do 20 damage on you. 
and the shrine is going to give me some more damage. So at least he didn't explode. Um, at least not yet. Uh, didn't use any welders. Didn't use any, you know, other cards that this deck uses, like some of the stadiums, the far stadiums it likes to use. So, you know, that's good enough. So there's the welder. I guess I spoke too soon. Where are you going to put the energies on? So it makes sense for him to put it on the active Mewtwo. It's going to be able to take another hit no matter what against the deck I'm using. And then it'll probably heal all the damage with that GX attack. It, it really sucks, but that's another one of the downsides. You know, this these against these tag team GXs, you don't kill them in one shot. They have so many ways to heal. All right. And there's the Jirachi down. That's a bit unfortunate. He finally managed to see it. At least if I got like one or two attacks with Dusknor before that Jirachi came down, it would have been something. It would have given me it would have given me that little bit of edge. But now it's too late. So he decided to just put the energy on the bench to Mewtwo, and he just put one, not two. Uh, he's still getting KOs pretty easy because of my low HP. And uh, what should I do? Should I just... I'm going to target the Jirachi, you know what, because uh, it has weak HP, and if I get rid of it, I can hit for weakness. Because you know what? No matter what I do, if I just put enough damage on the Mewtwo, he's just going to heal. So, I'm just going to try and target down the Jirachi, and maybe we can surprise KO it before he realizes. So, there's the Aramel giving me Shrine. Uh, I already have Shrine down, but I'm just going to get it for backup. And finally, Dusknoir. What I wanted to see. And the third Aramel, Cynthia. I believe we didn't use a supporter yet, so this is going to be good. Good that I got that. So, Rare Candy, Dusknor, get into play, my guy. Uh, and be ready to fuck somebody up. Man, two Duskles dead already. Crap. And the worst part is, because we don't have Stretcher or Super Rod, you know, Lure Ball forces me to search to recycle Evolution Pokemon. Tool bag, get the spell tags, and you know, Mimi Q. I guess I'm gonna use you too. Uh, let's see, put the spell tag on you. I didn't use treasure because I'm pretty sure the last dust school is in the prizes. So 60 damage, put a high a high count of damage counters with the shrine, and it's looking good. I mean, shrine is putting in the work. It's just great. It's the only way you're going to have a chance to win. Uh, it's thanks to that stadium. And you know what? I know that power plant is a thing too. And maybe it would have been good for me to run that and shut down Mewtwo. But I think I like the damage counters with Shrine. Just put that pressure up. Uh, I like I like its sort of effect. Reminds me of the uh, Desert Ruins. I think it was called from the EX Deoxys set cool stuff okay so he finally got rid of my stadium but I mean it's it did good enough I mean if I had it for like what four turns there maybe even more uh, no complaints we're gonna get the other ones so the Mewtwo has 190 damage is close to dying I'm actually gonna go ahead and kill it if he doesn't heal then I'm definitely gonna put those damage counters and get rid of it but he's using the Rainbow Brush, which is a weird card, but I guess it makes a little bit of sense in this deck. Since you recycle the energies. And I'm pretty sure he's going to try and go with that new 2 GX attack. Just heal all the damn damage. But I hope you don't. I hope you don't manage to. So there's Bill. Bill's research. He's going to go for it. But if you do that, it means there's no welder. So I hope I get damn lucky here. Just don't use the GX attack. It's all I want. So Welder and Fire Crystal. 
Okay, so he's getting ready for next turn at least. And uh, let's see. Are you ready to attack? Yeah, this game is 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 kind of is kind of long. It's gonna take a while. Make your move. No matter what you do, if you kill the Dusknoir, I'm getting my damage. Getting my damage on you. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna KO the Mewtwo since I have the opportunity here. I thought he was gonna heal it long before. So there it goes with the Outrage. And uh, time to die, Mewtwo. And Mew. So put three damage counters, put uh, four damage counters. Indeed get the exact KO on the Mewtwo. So perfect. Get my three prizes. I kind of need to get prizes too. See some stuff. There's a Duskull. I knew you were there. And Cynthia. Okay. So, uh, I'm going to have to sort of uh, use Mimikyu this turn anyway. But it's fine. It's fine. It's got the it's got the spell attack on. Uh, I can do a little bit of damage on its own. I mean, Dusknor does 60 anyway. Uh, this guy does 40 on two Pokemon total, so it's not that crazy of a difference. But I'm going to discard a few cards, go with the Dusclops evolution here, use the ability, because we have resources to spare now. Uh, I need to make sure I get the Dusknor next turn 100%, not worry about candies and shit. So make use of that right now. Go with the Cynthia. I mean, maybe I didn't need to do it, but I just did it anyway. And Shrine of Punishment again on the field. Let's see, Alana's Fishing Rod. I gotta, I gotta get Spell Tech and one of the Duskulls, uh, since we haven't used the Lure Ball yet. So Mysterious Treasures is what Pidgeot is gonna give me, and I kind of need energies now, actually. We have all of our Pokemon. Uh, I think there's there's only one spell tag I need to kind of grab uh, to have in hand, but I don't need it just yet. And it's down to what he gets. You know, if everything goes according to plan, I should have enough damage on his field. And with spell tag and Dusknoir, Dusknoir's ability to wrap up the game. So target the Latios and the Jirachi there. Since since those guys took a lot of damage from the shrine while it was down, it's in my interest to target those guys down as opposed to Mewtwo. And it works out better that way. And I just hope, hope that he doesn't heal in time. But, you know, Welder gets those two energies now. He's going to be able to put them on crap and he hasn't manually attached yet so rainbow brush it's gonna put a fire energy back in the deck get a psychic what he needs fucking out and there's the other fire so you know what's coming he's gonna go for the GX attack and just remove all the damage that I made put so much effort uh, to put put that damage on crap I mean there's no way he's not gonna do that I mean I think yeah he can't win if he uses uh, uh, Espeon's and Deoxys GX attack it's gonna get rid of my shrine too to add insult to injury god damn so we're back to square one. But I mean, I could still do it, I think. It's going to be rough, but Miraculous Duo GX, there it is. Heal all the damage from all Pokemon. And you guys can see just how insanely broken this Mewtwo is. Uh, so now, since he healed all the damage, now we are going to target the Mewtwo. It's just so insane. Like, even if you can't use its ability, you know, the GX attack is so broken. It's insane. I mean, you know, Venusaur and Celebi can only heal the damage from his own ass. This guy heals it from everybody. Damn. 
but we're gonna get another Duskull out and since he needs to get two more prizes if I play my cards right I think we can still do it we still got a shot at this I just gotta get the spell tech plus 100% uh, we get the shrine again the shrine will have to stay if I'm gonna have a chance to win uh, I gotta spread those damage counters fast and it really sucks because if I could have at least KO'd the Jirachi, I will be able to hit for 120. So that's significant. So I get the candy with Aramel. I just need to get the other Dusknor, or actually the Little Ball, because Dusknor is dead, the other one. And Psy up. That's what's up. Just 60 damage and spread the damage counters. So. The good news is, is that all his eggs are in that one Mewtwo basket. With 110 damage. Okay, he got rid of my stadium again. Crap. But if I just put 8 eight damage counters with Dusknorm, if he kills it, and then use the other Dusknorm, maybe I can do it. I think there's... Maybe there's another spell tag in the deck. I'm not sure. But, you know, things are definitely hard. You better believe it. So he's using Welder again. I mean, if he if he like retreats the Mewtwo, I don't think I'm gonna have a chance. But let's see what he does. Uh, can he make the dude ready yet? So there's the third Fire Energy. Ain't that a bitch? What will you do? That is the question. Hmm. I think I actually used all of the Shrines of Punishment too. Like, I don't think we have any left. He's going to draw a card with the Custom Catcher. Yeah, I don't want you to target down any of the other guys. I need this Dusknor to sort of take the hit and die. And it's going to go with Venom Shot. What? Dude, okay, so that was a really dumbass move on his part. I don't know why he did that. He got rid of the the Pidgeotto there. It's not like I really needed to have all three now, and didn't even target the Dusko. Uh, I guess he's gonna. His thinking is that I'm gonna try and snipe the guys down on the bench, so you don't get the plus with spell tag. Uh, but the thing is, is that, you know, what you did, now I'm going to be able to hit you for 120. So, I'm not sure if that was the wisest move on his end. And since I have space now, we're going to play the new. So, no more spread for you. So, 120 damage. Uh, this new two is dead. And I think we're going to go for a draw here because he can't snipe me down now. And... If he if he kills the the Dusknor, if he doesn't use Custom Catcher, which I think he used quite a few, uh, we're gonna go for a draw. <laughs> this might be a draw in a long time. It's been like I think I only drew like two times in, in all the years I played TCG online. I'm not I don't remember, but we're gonna go for a draw here. I think. Uh, okay, and it seems. He's putting all the energies on this dude again. What? Okay, so final move. And he's going to go for Venom Shot again. Okay, so th this guy doesn't know what Mew does. All right, so. Okay, yeah. Right, so this would have been a draw. If he, if he actually KO'd the Dusknor, uh, it was going to be a draw. I wasn't going to win, but at least he wasn't going to lose. But now with that move... He pretty much gave me the game. So, a bit unexpected. I don't know what he was thinking. Maybe he's a novice player, not a lot of experience. I don't know if he was paying attention that I played them new. But it's GG for me. Victory for me. Hope you guys enjoyed this game. Hope you guys subscribe. Leave a like and share this video with your friends. Gotta win with Dusknor. Uh, that's what's up. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. And we'll see